Hi, my name is Mike. Thanks for joining me today on my channel, Technically Church, where I share over 20 years of experience in audio, video, lighting, and multimedia. You can always find out more on my website at technicallychurch.com. Let's jump in. I'm gonna show you how to set up and configure using the Stream Deck to control your Blackmagic Video Hub. So you can control via the push of a button uh, different routings on your Video Hub. You can program it ahead of time and just push the button and it'll reroute the Video Hub for you using the Stream Deck, it's a super cool feature. All right, I'm gonna show you how to set up a Blackmagic Video Hub in the Stream Deck interface so that the Stream Deck can control that Video Hub and do some input routing. So we'll go to the BitFocus Companion GUI you would click on your BitFocus Companion app and go to Launch GUI if it's not open. And under Connections, we want to go ahead and add the Video Hub. So over Add Connection, we're going to search for Blackmagic. And you can see all their products here. And you can see here is the Blackmagic Design Video Hub. So I'm going to click Add. All right, so I'm going to leave, um, you can leave this at Manual and type in the IP address if you know it or it's also gonna scan your network and if it can find it, it will find the video hub and you can just select it here. So I have the Smart Video Hub 40 by 40. I have 40 inputs and 40 outputs. So I'm gonna go ahead and click Save there. So now you see I have a Video Hub connection set up with a green check on the status, which means it can communicate. So now let's go ahead and set up a button and I'll show you how the input uh, routing works for this. So we'll go over to Buttons. I have a blank page here on my Stream Deck set up. So I'm going to click on the first uh, button here and click Create Button. So maybe this is, um, I want to route camera one to projectors. Okay, obviously you could do any inputs, any outputs, whatever routing you want to do. This is just an example. So I'm going to route camera one directly to my projectors when I press this button. So obviously I could change the font size, the text color, the background color, I could add an image, all sorts of stuff there. So I'm gonna scroll down to the actions and under the press action, what do I want to happen when I press this button? I'm gonna click browse and I want it to control the video hub. And I wanna do a route, so I'm gonna click route. Click done. All right, so now you see I have the Video Hub route command loaded in. So again, what happens when I press this button? The source uh, is gonna be camera one. So it's already on camera one. Obviously I could pick whatever input I needed. So I want the source to be camera one. And then I want my destination to be, maybe in this case, my projector two. So it's gonna route camera one to projector two when I press that button. You could add a delay in if you don't want it to happen right away. And you could also stack actions. So that's the simple way of just adding a route in. And I'll show you how to stack an action as well. So this is going to route camera one to projector two. Maybe I want to put a different camera on my other projector. So under actions, I'm going to add a second action to the same button. So it's going to do two actions when I press the same, the one button. So I'm going to browse. Under video hub, I'm going to click route again. So now I have a second action. And in this case, I'm gonna put camera two on projector one. I have two projectors. So when I press this one button now, it's gonna do two things. It's gonna put camera one on projector two, and it's gonna put camera two on projector one. So this is a quick example of how you can stack actions, which is really cool. Uh, if you have you know, a subset of actions you need to do, you can have one button that triggers them all. Thanks for joining me today. Again, my name is Mike. You can always find out more on my website, technicallychurch.com, or on my YouTube channel, Technically Church. Look forward to seeing you soon.